I want to talk about an issue that's pretty dear to your heart because it has to do with your district. We're talking about the fire training school in Beacon Falls. Governor Lamont had gone down there during his campaign and said that he wanted to help reopen it. Uh, money hasn't fully been approved for that to happen. What are you hearing about that at this point? Well, the, you know, we don't really hear a lot about it. I, you know, I'm the kind of person, if I say I'm going to do something, I'll do it. And I know you're going to hear from the good lieutenant governor uh, in a little while. And she and Governor Lamont came down to our district, our area where that fire school um, is supposed to be built, and promised that it would get built if they got elected. And it hasn't been built so far. I'm hoping that we have time and that will be funded at some point in the future. But What's the you, price tag on that? You talk about $14 million, mm -hmm. um, give or take. You know, it changes in time because there's different. it has to go out to bid again. So that money may change a little bit, but it's yeah. within a range. Here's the bottom line. We talk about prioritizing. The governor talks about prioritizing bonding, and that has been his focus, limiting bonding in the state of Connecticut, because he recognizes that we've borrowed too much in this state. But our perspective is you have to prioritize what we're borrowing. And if we don't believe that, for the most part, volunteer firefighters who give their lives every day on their off time for our safety and to save our lives is not a priority, I don't know what is.